National Transportation Safety Board blames a deadly 2015 train crash in Philadelphia on a combination of human error and the lack of fail-safe technology. The safety agency also says vandalism played an indirect role in the tragedy, which claimed eight lives. Brian Moore has the story in Washington. May 12, 2015, a commuter train in Philadelphia is pelted by rocks, setting off a chain of events that led to a deadly error by the engineer of another train, Amtrak Northeast Regional 188. He went in a matter of seconds from distraction to disaster. An investigation by the National Transportation Safety Board finds the engineer, Brandon Boston, was distracted by radio dispatches about the vandalism and went into a curve at 106 miles an hour, more than 50 miles over the speed limit. The locomotive and seven cars hurtled off the tracks, killing eight and injuring more than 200. While human error played a significant role, the NTSB also faulted the absence of a fail-safe braking system known as positive train control. If they had had PTC installed in this section of track, this would not have occurred. Those lives would not have been lost. And it's technology the NTSB has been pushing for decades. I'm very concerned that we're going to be back in this room again, hearing investigators detail how technology that we have recommended for more than 45 years could have prevented yet another fatal accident. Well, Amtrak says it has implemented the automatic controls across much of the heavily traveled Northeast Corridor. The railway takes full responsibility for the crash and promised to carefully review the NTSB's recommendations. Brian Moore, NBC News, Washington.